What's up, y'all? Y'all tuning in with Golf and Mook, y'all. What it do? How y'all doing today? Um, Make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, tell a friend, and tell a friend, and come check us out, y'all. Um, So I know we haven't been posting in, a, um, in about, what, five days, y'all? We've been super, super slim trying to open up this business. Um, It's been great. I thank God every day. I thank all of y'all. A hey, shout out to everybody on YouTube that has came in this store and purchased mattresses. Whether it's the kids who has brought their parents in here or the parents that just came here. I should have took pictures of everybody who came in here and supported us from YouTube. It's amazing. So, y'all, it's important to give back and be humble and be good to people because you know where the you never know where the support gonna come from, right? That's why I always try to go out and support people and show the same type of love because you just never know. So, man, we are super blessed and highly favored. Our business haven't even been open for two weeks yet, and it's doing really, really well. Um, and I'm sure in a bit, well, I know in a business you have good days, bad days. But, yeah, all so far, so good. So, we are very thankful for that. Um, Golf couldn't get on here right now because he's on delivery. Um, but, man, it is such a good feeling to just be in a place of your own business and, um you know, don't have to worry about somebody saying, do this, do that, or clock in this time, or you late, or you this, you that, you know, um, it is an amazing feeling, I thank God for this, and I pray for it, he made sure it happened, you know, but when you want something to happen from God, of course, you got to make the first, you got to make steps too, you got to meet him halfway, that's how I feel, and he do the rest, so we've been putting in a lot of hard work, meaning going out, Walmart, errands, rent -a center um big lies um walking the streets just passing out flyers and cars hand in hand to people standing on a corner with signs like so what you i would have never thought because i'm weird yeah i'm not weird like i the flyer thing that's me okay but i would never thought i'd be standing over passing out signs but in order to have a successful business you get out of what you put in so you got to go to extra mile so I'm out there like, yes, come and shop Mattress Outlet Stockbridge. So if y'all haven't heard it yet, make sure y'all come and check us out. Mattress Outlet Stockbridge, y'all. We are open uh, Monday through Saturday, Monday through Thursday, 11 to 6, Friday and Saturday, 11 to 5. And yes, your girl will be here. Okay. So, um, man, it's just amazing, y'all. So I thank y'all so much. And, um, even some of my Facebook people that has came in, but I have to have more YouTube people than anything. So it's like, wow, it's important to sow seeds and just build your own platform because it makes stuff a little easier, right? So I guess I just get on here to just say I'm super thankful and I'm so thankful for y'all and I thank y'all and I love y'all so much. And we will be starting the giveaways again next month. Um, I want to do something different though. Like I just thought it would be good to give away money because everybody can use money but i don't know i guess i want to put them in a situation like okay do you prefer this or this where you can have options because i believe you do good every day it's important to give back so that's always my motto i gotta give back like i just gotta give back i'm a giving person anybody that knows me they might say i'm a piece of work but you know we all have our days and nobody is perfect and that de and definitely not me but i love to give people stuff and i love just to see people smile and um to make them happy i guess you know and i love to help people in need that's always been my thing and i said this year i want to be a um better aunt to my nieces and nephews because i always knew them well, I know when my kids grew up, they didn't have like a auntie or uncle. Well, some of my brothers, but they didn't really have that. Nobody that looked out for them or did this or did that or whatever, which it don't really matter. But I just want to be better. I want my nieces and nephews to be able to call me for whatever or know that they auntie is going to come through. So that was one of my things, one of my goals of this year. And I'm going to accomplish. Well, I've been doing better because I'm sure all my nieces and nephews can say I've been doing better. I call them more. If I don't call them, I text them. And... You also have to let the kids know, you know, it worked both ways. I call you, you call me. I call you, you call me. You call me, I call you. So it worked like that too. So, um, yeah, so that's where I'm at. Um, the twins, you haven't been seeing them. So they've been on set since March 5th and they don't get done till March 18th. So I miss them so much. I would have never. Now, when we move out and go our separate ways in November, it's going to be very, very weird because right now the house is so quiet. 
and nobody is knocking on my door saying mom 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 so it feels really really weird right and i call them every day um i go out you can't really interact with them because of the covid and stuff so um i'm not allowed to go out on set but i do go sit at a hotel and take them like long corns and steaks and stuff that's what they want or i'll take them a lot of goodie bags and i see them at the top and they like waving like mom and i'm like oh my god it's not so much so yeah that's where we at so if y'all haven't been seeing much of them they've been working y'all so don't think they forgot about y'all i just thought last night like oh my god i gotta get something on youtube like asap right but i've been so tired trying to get this store together y'all know how it is all y'all business owners entrepreneurs y'all know how it go you got to put in the work so sometimes you can't move like normally right okay so anyway so this is what i've been working on getting a store together so this is my little office of course i does all the hiring and marketing and oh and i'm, I'm hiring some people too because it's a lot of work okay so this is my little office and yes we do notary yeah i'm a um public notary um and this is like our little setup you know we have like the name brands and so all we sell is mattress and box springs all sizes or whatever but yeah and it's already looking kind of empty because we've been going crazy in here right so yeah so i'm just still setting up and we do we also do snap um people can come in and finance of course um but yeah, this is where we at, y'all. So, who haven't, those of you who have not came, make sure y'all come and check us out so y'all can see your girl, get a picture of something with me, you know? So, um, that's what's going on. But I'm like, I had to come talk to my family because I didn't want them to think I just like, you know, nah, that ain't, that ain't it, right? Yeah, um, so that's what I've been on. Um, Y'all know my birthday is next weekend. Oh, and my nails, my hair. Guess what, y'all? I've been working out every day. I've been found time to work out Um, when I get off of here at 6 or whatever. And guess what? I could barely even get out the bed Um, this morning. So we've been doing, we've been doing leg work, leg work, right? And, um... Yeah. <sighs> it was an ant. Hate bugs. Um, anyway, we've we've been doing leg work and y'all know when y'all doing squats and stuff. Oh my god, I could not even sit on the toilet. Like the top of my legs were in so much pain all night. So when I was getting up in the middle of the night to use the bathroom, I literally was like this, y'all. Tiptoeing. Because that's how bad my legs hurt. So bad. So, I don't know what we're going to do today because the leg thing, maybe I'll just do some walking like on a treadmill or something. I don't know, but this shit was awful. Um, what else, y'all? Um, so, that's everybody's been extremely busy. So, that's why y'all haven't been seeing much of us, but we about to get back to it. So, I'm going to do like this big old thing for my babies when they get home. Retta is home, so... We're going to get some in tonight. I don't know how long he's going to be here, which I'm sure he's probably only here for my birthday. Um, and it's all good in the hood or whatever, right? I'm just glad to see my baby. So I make sure we get some in with him. It's just I can never keep up with him. When I get home and get wind down, I'm ready to go to sleep. I was so tired last night. I probably went to bed like at 10 o'clock. And, and I'm never doing nothing like that. I at least go to bed about 3, 4 in the morning. But, honey i'm getting old i'm like oh i gotta be getting old i can't even move like i normally move or just sit up and chill and kick it i'm tired like i'm so tired but like i said you get out of what you put in so it's important that you work 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 right so i'm just so i'm so happy oh my god i'm so happy and plus y'all have to get golf on here y'all so y'all can see that hair my baby been looking fine so sexy yes i just love him he looks he looks really really nice and now he has like the little afro and it's like really really curly all of that good stuff so yeah we have to get Bay back on here um what have i been doing y'all 
I've been drinking these nasty little V8 shakes that's been having me run into the bathroom. Just trying to get myself together. So I said, God did one thing in my life. Well, he, well, he wakes me up every day. So he do a lot of my life. Don't get that twisted. So I'm like, now I need to start working on me. I feel like we're doing okay. You know, now I got to start working on my body and my health. I'm back drinking my tea, which I have been shitting weight like a mug. Y'all probably can't tell because I haven't really been seeing videos of me. Um, complete, you know, but um, yeah. That's where we at. So I'm about to get my hair done, y'all. So guess what? This is my last time with long hair. The next hairstyle I'm about to get for my birthday. But after that, it's going to be a brand new me. I'm about to do a whole new makeover because I need something new in my life. And me and my husband agreed to do it together. But, honey, he he was moving too fast. So I just went in and got him right. And it looks really good on him. Mm. Ooh, shit. But, uh, yeah, I had to jump on here, y'all. And talk to y'all and let y'all know that we appreciate y'all. We're going to get back to business. We just had to get this store up and running and moving well. So, I thank y'all um, for everything. And I thank everybody that has been stopping in, showing us love, and actually supporting us. Um, so, when you give back, see, it comes right back around, you know. All that good stuff. But, um, tomorrow, tomorrow is the 14th. I think it'll be eight years or nine years i think it'll be eight years tomorrow that my mother-in-law has passed away so this week and last week has been really really rough for my husband you know but i'm gonna make it great tomorrow because that's what i do so i'm gonna make it great i'm gonna make him feel better you know i could never ever i wish i could bring her back a thousand times i wish i could bring a lot of folks back but you know how that is so, I'm going to try to make hubby feel as comfortable as possible, you know, and be there right when he need me, and we're going to move from there. But, y'all, thank y'all, and I love y'all, and y'all stay tuned. Peace.